Okay, so I did quite a few renovations on the tank. Pretty much scrapped the under gravel system. Went ahead, got this, uh, I don't know what it is, some sort of a filter that attaches to the bottom of the power head and I can, you know, no longer have the under gravel filter. Replace the substrate with number 30 silica sand and it was like nine dollars for a hundred pounds and I think it looks fucking pimp I'm very very glad that I did that um, what I also did is I pretty much rearranged all the rocks um, I felt it was too crammed in there and I wanted to have a little bit more open space so I could actually see my fish instead of searching around the whole tank for them um, pretty much pushed all the rocks towards the back um, got that big rock right there, still concealing uh, the pump as best as possible. Got some uh, cool algae starting to grow on these rocks. The java fern and the moss looks like it's doing good. Picked up an Anubius, got it tied off to a small little rock. Um, when it gets bigger, I want to actually transplant it into this corner and fill in that back area and kind of hide the heater a little bit. Um, but in order to do that, I have to push this cave forward, etc. Um, right now, I'm just going to let everything kind of do its thing for a while. I got some moss back here I put up on the um, the slate, and I'm hoping that the moss on the, from the, behind the slate and on this log will kind of merge and cover that slate with moss. I think that would look pretty cool. Um, I like this rock. It's like giving you the finger, pretty much. And... That's pretty much how I feel about being at work and such, so fuck you. Got some duckweed. Duckweed looks pretty good. I hope it multiplies, fills up the top, and kind of covers up uh, some of that light and maybe show some better color on the fish. But anyway, that's what I've done, so it's going to keep evolving. Thanks a lot.